sensitivity um, with very limited experience with him myself whereas my experience was much more uh, prevalent with Hillary Clinton because Hillary is also uh, bisexual leaning more towards a homosexual end and it was she who accessed my sex programming to fulfill her perversions. Anna, look at me. Riley thinks you've absolutely lost your mind. Huh? Riley thinks you've lost your mind. She thinks you have. I didn't. Is this a mushroom trip? Huh? Is this a mushroom trip? Huh? Is this a mushroom trip? <laughs> I'm kidding. Is that me? I'm kidding. I said this footage is worth money. Why? What footage? This thing you're looking into? It's a camera. Exactly. Cheers, butterfly. The woods are lovely, dark, and deep, and I have promises to keep and miles to go before I sleep. Did you hear me, butterfly? Miles to go before you sleep. This is a warning. Seriously, because maybe 90% of you, if not more, somewhere between 90 and 100 percent of you in this room are programmed and we're going to talk about that between now and Sunday in various formats that's why you're attracted to this class maybe that's why you were attracted to me in the first place but almost all of you in this room have some form of programming whether it was specific or general and we'll talk about that during the evening and day tomorrow as well the reason I have a warning up there is because I have to warn you that somewhere between Friday and Saturday it's a possibility, maybe a likelihood, <laughs> that I might say a word or a phrase or put something on the blackboard or show something to you or someone else in the room might discuss something that could trigger you or that could set off an activation of a program within you. I need you to be aware of that. Now, during the course of the weekend, you will learn certain techniques <laughs> on self-deprogramming. My name is Bryce Taylor, and I'm a 48-year-old native Californian. My multiple personality condition resulted from what I had first thought in 1986 was solely sexual and ritual abuse. But as I began to remember and heal more of my hidden past, I realized that ritual abuse was merely the mind control, trauma base my pedophile father and others used to condition me for participation in Project Monarch, the Central Intelligence Agency's white slavery operation. Mind control sex slaves are created by um, starting with a child from birth, and inducing trauma, which for me was done in the form of being sexually abused and then being satanically abused. I was put through a trial of satanic rituals, which means um, there were blood rituals done where I was forced to witness um, animals and people being sacrificed. We were taken down the basement and it turned into um, kitty porn where we were being filmed. I was an FBI agent for 27 and a half years. Bryce Taylor's story has been confirmed over and over again through my various sources. Judges, law enforcement, prosecutors, attorneys, doctors, and many, many prominent individuals, including actors, actresses, professional football and baseball players, are involved in these type of activities. Among them were John F. Kennedy, Lyndon Baines Johnson, Nelson Rockefeller, Henry Kissinger, Gerald Ford, Jimmy Carter, 
Ronald Reagan, George Bush, and top entertainment professionals such as my owner, Bob Hope. Then I was prostituted or they would make some pornography or something. The theme of the pornography uh, filmed by Sylvester Stallone was um, sex with dolphins. They filmed us over, t over years with all sorts of animals. I would just like to tell the Queen of England that whether a person's under mind control or not, that no one has a right to take a child from someone and that if she didn't know I was under mind control, that, that I would, you know, understand, but that, you know, I would just appeal to her as, as a mother and ask for her cooperation in this situation that I could be at least reunited with my son. If you go back uh, 225 or 30 years ago, you have what we call the Illuminati that was established uh, in 1776. And the goals of the Illuminati, this is all very well documented, are to take over the world. One of the best ways of taking over the world is to control people's minds.